Welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VII. I have no idea what I'm really supposed to be doing because I genuinely don't remember. But we've got a car thing that can travel over a little bit of water. Uh, no, not that. This, though. Then you can ice that one. You can quake them. Right? Maybe. Oh, I didn't need to heal. What am I thinking? Oh, well. Alright, does that affect them? Yes, it does. That's rude. How dare you. Okay, that's dead. You take some damage. You're dead. Okay. I was really hoping I wouldn't have to use that. Uh, well, let's just go to this destroyed village. Uh, what you got? Please buy something. Oh, what do you got? I don't really need any of that. What do you got? I don't know if I need transform. Don't think I need any of those. Alright, you got weapons. I don't have either of them on my team. Oh, I will take that though. Sure, it makes it to where my materia for uh, the all effect on Quake will be... Oh, I've got that here? No. There we go. Oh! We're back to the go- what? How do we make my way back here? I don't know how I'm on my way back there, but I don't want to be there. Uh, oh, battle. Battle time! Oh, I don't want to deal with these! And just because that doesn't look like it's going to be much fun. Rude. It's okay. That guy should be dead now. He's still living. Well, that's a pretty cool looking sword. Yeah, he's dead now. And now we're all healed up. And good to keep killing. Ow. Ow. Rude. You can... You take a lot less damage than I thought you would. Okay. Ouch. Let's get a nice heal off again. Uh, looks like we're gonna need to uh, use an either, get her magic back up. Item, either. There we go. Um, 
that's that town. No. Trying to find out if that's enough to kill them or not. I guess we'll find out. Um, it is not. Is her whacking it again? Is that gonna be enough to kill it then? No. That's okay. She'll keep whacking that one until it dies. Maybe. Actually, Red will probably be the one that kills it. Yep. Red kills it. That's okay. You tried, Eris. You tried. Alright. And then... Yeah, we can cross right there. What do we got over here? Just mount more mountains that I can't do all things on. Oh, it's a troll. It's a troll thing. Rude. Wait. Uh, yeah, I should probably do that. You can take a fire too. And then a physical attack. Rude. Ha! You're dead. That's what you get for being rude. Though I guess to be fair, I'm the one that entered into his territory. So... Okay, yep, can't go that way. Ah. Okay. Oh, battle time. What do we got? What do we got? We got... Ooh, we get a back attack on the troll thing. Well, now you're dead. Yeah, you're definitely dead. Only dealt like 600-ish points of damage. Only. Uh, what do we got over here? That's a part we can cross. There's another town like right up here, I think. Uh, what are these tusked horse things? Is Fire 2 even gonna do anything to that? What the fuck did it just do? It tried petrifying me. And it's being very successful at it. Ah, you're dead. And I think... I th think... I guess we don't need the heal. We didn't really need the heal. What am I doing? I am paying no attention to what I'm doing. That's okay. Dead? Dead. Okay. Okay. So, moving on. Is it a little town here? No, what? It's more mountain bit. I want the little town over here. What? 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 <laughs> oh man. Unless that's exactly what's supposed to happen. Cosmo Canyon. I am home. It is I, Nanaki. Hey Nanaki, you're safe. Come on and say hello to 
Bogenhagen. Nanaki? Welcome to Cosmo Canyon. Are you familiar with this land? Nope, not at all. Uh, people from all over the world gather here to seek and the study of planet life. I'm a guy. Mm, uh, I don't know what that's supposed to sound like. Oh well. I'm sorry. It's full now, so you, I can't let you enter. What? They helped me when I was on the road. Please let them in. Was oh, that so? You helped our Nanaki. Please come in. Who's Nanaki? Nanaki is Nanaki. That's his name. Okay. All right, Tifa, you're in. And I assume he wants us to go this way. So let's let's just go ahead and uh, follow along. Here it's where I was. I mean, this is my hometown. My tribe were protectors of those who appreciate this beautiful canyon and the planet. My brave mother fought and died here, but my cowardly father left her, and I am the last of my race. Cowardly father? Yes, my father was a worst trail. And so the mission I inherited from my ancestors is to protect this place. My journey ends here. Hey, Nanaki, you're home. Oh, I didn't read that right at all. Oh, well. Coming, Grandpa. Let's rest for a bit. And there are some things I want to find out about anyways. Tasty cocktails, pub starlet, fluffy beds, and Shildra Inn. Come in today. It's right near Cosmo Cradle. Right there. Okay. And right there. Ah, yay! Save point. I don't have to go back out of town to save. Perfect. Oh, welcome. The people of this canyon hate to compete, so almost everything here are replicas. But that's alright. Some of them you can really use. Uh... Dang it, didn't I just upgrade my weapon? Uh Okay, Tifa... Oh, I don't have the money now. Okay, well... I guess we're gonna re-upgrade my weapon. Even though I literally just did. <laughs> This one. I don't know what that is, so we'll just equip it. And then we'll talk to you again. It's sell. So we don't need that. We don't need that. And I don't really use these. Don't use that. Don't use that. Nope, we do sell the, do use those. Actually, you know what? The potions aren't really useful. Uh, sell those. Um. Um, okay. I don't know how to tell which one of these is currently better, so we'll just call that good. Then, we'll save again. Because I've edited my inventory and stuff. I'm guessing we go through here. Where did I put it? I know it's around here. Okay, I guess we don't go through there. Maybe we go over here? Oh god, there's space up here too? What, what, okay. What do we got here? What do we got here? 
Another ancient. Oh god, there are so many rooms! Buchenhagen sealed this door shut. How'd he do that? With super glue? Uh. God, there's a ladder here too. I don't know where I'm going. Aha, but this was the right area. I so smart sometimes. Hmm, Mike said, this is my grandfather, Gurgen. He is incredible, he knows everything. Ho ho ho, I hear that you looked after Nonaki. Nonaki is still a child, you see. Please stop, grandfather, I am 48. Ho ho ho, Nonaki's tribe is in, has incredible longevity. So you see, his 48 years would be only equivalent to, to say that of a 15 or 16 year old human reckoning. 15 or 16? He is quite and very deep. You thought he was an adult? Grandf grandfather, I want to be an adult. I want to grow up to be able to protect you in this village. Ho ho ho. No, Nanaki. You can't stand on your own yet. I'd say he's plenty more than capable of standing on his own. To do that, now you would that now you would destroy To do that now would destroy you in the long run. Reaching up to the heavens, threatening to snatch the very stars from the great city of Midgard. You've seen it, haven't you? Well, that's a bad example. Looking up too much makes you lose perspective. When it's time for the planet to die, you'll understand that you know absolutely nothing. When the planet dies? Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho, it may be tomorrow, or a hundred years from now, but it's not long off. How do you know this? I hear the cries of the planet. What's that? Indeed, what is it? I am curious. The sounds of the stars in the heavens. While this goes on, planets are born and die. And what about that one? And that one? Ho oh, ho ho! That was a scream from the planet. Don't, didn't you hear it? As if it, to say, I hurt, I suffer. The They've come here on a journey to save the planet. Why don't you show them your apparatus? Ho ho ho! To save the planet! Ho oh, ho ho ho! But then again, I guess it wouldn't hurt the show. Bugenhagen! Several odd looking people are here. The whole place has gotten busy all of a sudden. He brought friends too. I'll go get them. Mechshen, please call one of them. Only three people can fit in Grandfather's machine. What? And so, I guess I need to also go out? Uh, right ladder. Uh, we came from this way. Actually, okay, well, let's just go this. Let's find our way back down and go from there. What? But did you say that people were here? Or is that saying here is in, in the actual place? Oh, haha! -ha! I've been, I've been. Are you going somewhere? Found them. Um. Yep, come along. And actually, it looks like we can just go right back up this way. Uh, I assume back here. Nope, not back here. What's back here, maybe? What is back here? Oh, it's Red Room! 
Don't worry about me. I've seen it many times. I haven't been back for a while. Let me rest a bit. No. Absolutely not. <laughs> no rest for you. Though, I don't really get the choice. You get a rest. Okay, and then we need to go back this way. Through here. Up here, over here. Then around, up and over, and then back and over and there. And then up the ladder. And then we go back in here. Over here! Over here! The door's unlocked, come in! Oh! Oh ho ho! Ho ho ho! It looks like you have them all together. Then let's just begin. I'll stand there. Ooh. Oh boy. What do we got here? It's so pretty. It's just like the real thing. Hmm, yes, pretty good. This is my laboratory. All the workings of this space are entered into this 3D holographic system. Hey, a shooting star. Oh, okay. And a planet with moons. And the asteroids. This is pretty cool. Pretty cool. And it's a black hole. That's exactly what you want to see. Wow, how wonderful. Oh, ho, ho. Yes, it is something, isn't it? Well, let's get to the subject. Eventually, all humans die. What happens to them after they die, though? The body decomposes and returns to the planet. That much everyone knows. What about their consciousness, their hearts and their souls? The soul, too, returns to the planet. And not only those of humans, but everything on the planet. In fact, all living things in the universe are the same. The spirits that return to the planet merge with one another and roam the planet. They roam, converge, and divide, and becoming a swell called the life stream. Life stream, in other words, a path of energy of the souls roaming the planet. Spirit energy is a word that you should never forget. That's two words, but okay. A new life. Children are blessed with spirit energy and are brought into the world. Then the time comes when they die and once again return to the planet. Of course there are exceptions, but this is the way of the world. I've, I've digressed, but you... You'll understand better if you watch this. Spirit energy is the source of life for trees, birds, and humans. Not only living things, it makes it possible to form planets. And if that spirit energy were to disappear...
Hmm. Planet toys. These are the basics of the study of the planet life. Hmm. If spirit energy disappears, our planet's gonna die. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! Spirit energy is efficient because it exists within nature. When spirit energy is forcefully extracted and manufactured, it can't accomplish its true purpose. You're talking about Mako energy, right? Every day, Mako reactors suck up spirit energy, diminishing it. Spirit energy is compressed in reactors and processed into Mako energy. All living things are being used up and thrown away. In other words, Mako energy will only destroy the planet. The story of the planets and those li who lived with them. If you want to know more, then you must listen to the words of the elders. You're an elder. Tell me. Uh, okay. I guess I gotta talk to more people. I don't really wanna. But I will eventually. But... I think for now, what I will do is get right back to the save point, maybe, depending on how well I can walk and not run into walls. And with the save point, obviously save and call it an episode. So thank you all for watching, have a good day, and bye bye